Starfield is filled with items and resources to loot as you fight your way across the galaxy. But if you try to carry more than your mass allows, you won't only find yourself encumbered, but you'll notice your oxygen dropping rapidly as you move anywhere close to full speed, and you'll eventually take damage if you don't stop or slow down. Here's our guide on managing encumbrance, and how to best utilize your storage. When you're carrying more weight than your max capacity allows, a warning will appear in the top right corner of the screen that says running while encumbered will quickly drain your oxygen. If you ignore this warning and continue moving at full speed, even without sprinting, your oxygen bar will lower at a much faster rate than usual. Once that meter is depleted, your carbon dioxide will begin to increase, which can be seen as a red bar filling up on your watch in the lower left-hand side of the screen. If the CO2 bar completely fills on the meter, you'll start to take damage, so you'll need to slow down or stop altogether to catch your breath. You also won't be able to fast travel. Encumbrance isn't a death sentence. You can definitely work around it for brief periods of time, but it's in your best interest to avoid it whenever possible. So here's a few helpful hints that we've been using. Did you know you have access to two bins of unlimited storage space inside the lodge in New Atlantis? One is the storage locker in your bedroom, and the other is in the basement. This one seems obvious, but it's really more of a change in mindset. While it can be tempting to pick up everything, you really don't need to, and there's an opportunity cost to picking up a bunch of junk. Credits are an important resource, yes, but so is your carrying capacity, and your time. Why fill your inventory with a bunch of junk that's not worth much, when it can later be replaced with a more valuable item that weighs much less? If you're carrying too much and there aren't any storage containers nearby, you can drop any and all unwanted items to reduce your load. From your inventory menu, highlight the item you wish to throw out and select the corresponding drop key. If you have at least five of the same item, a pop-up will appear that asks you to select the amount you would like to throw out of your inventory. You can adjust the slider to drop however many of that item you see fit. It's also worth noting that items seem to stay on the ground for a decent chunk of time, so you could in theory drop what you don't need, fast travel back to the ship to unload more loot, and come back for the items you tossed out prior to leaving the area. But try not to hoard, it's really not worth it. Or do. Whatever. I'm not your mom. I think you may be trying to take a little too much on. Literally. If you're in a hurry, and want to keep the treasures you've stashed away, you can temporarily increase your capacity by consuming certain food or aid items. For example, the UC Battle Mail Multipack increases the amount of mass you can carry by 8 for 8 minutes. Keep in mind that this is only a temporary fix, and you'll still need to address your inventory space once the timer on the buff has expired. You also have the option to transfer some of that extra weight to your companion's inventory by speaking with them and selecting the Let's Trade Gear option. Once selected, a menu will appear that shows what your companion currently has in their inventory. Select the option to swap over to your inventory, and then select the items you would like to transfer. Quick tip, if you can't find your companion, open the ship menu from the character screen, select the companion you're looking for, and assign them to your ship. Now you'll be able to find them waiting for you when you're on board. Keep in mind that when you're using any tables or crafting stations, resources will not automatically be taken from your companion's inventory. You'll need to either transfer them back to your own inventory or the ship's cargo before being able to use them for research or crafting. If you're safely out of combat and near your ship, you will also have the option to store items in your captain's locker or cargo hold. The captain's locker can be located directly behind your seat and the cockpit, while your cargo hold can be accessed from anywhere within the ship. Pay attention to how much weight you're placing in these containers, as they also have mass limitations. If these extra storage spaces become filled to the brim, you'll either need to make a few sacrifices or sell off some of your items. Increasing your ship's storage capacity is also a viable option, as you can simply add more cargo holds in order to carry more mass on board. This does come with a setback, as you'll also need to upgrade several other parts of your ship in order to make up for the added weight, so it's more of a long-term solution. You can also get more out of the storage you currently have on your ship by investing in the skill payloads, which is in the second tier of the tech skill tree. One point will increase your cargo holds capacity by 10%, while maxing it out will increase it by 50%. Of course, the easiest way to avoid all of this is to sell off any unwanted or unneeded items you may have picked up. Even though carrying around whatever Starfield's equivalent of the lusty Argonian mage sure sounds like fun, it can get in the way of carrying much needed supplies like med packs, guns, and food. Once again, don't be a hoarder and sell what you don't need. And think of all the money you'll make. 
This may seem counter to everything I've just spent time explaining, but you can make it a good distance by running full speed, going into a slow trot for a bit to recover oxygen, and then going full speed again. Also, on low graph planets, using your boost pack will let your oxygen slowly refill. If you can put up with a blurry screen and having to take a few breaks during your weighty jaunt, then have at it, as you can't actually die from CO2 buildup. If you lose all your health from it and then get shot, however, that's a different story. So don't fill up your CO2 in the middle of a firefight. And that's our quick guide to dealing with encumbrance. Starfield is a massive game with many solutions to various problems. So what would you like us to cover in the future? Make sure to let us know in the comments below, and while you're here, check out our 15 essential tips and tricks. For everything else gaming, you're already in the right place. IGN. Don't leave any of that behind.